Hello and welcome to the Payment Village. My name is Leanne Galloway and I am the Payment Village lead. We set up the Payment Village because we felt like so many of us have an interaction with payment technologies every day, yet most of us don't know how they work. And it seems from the outside that the barriers for entry are particularly high. So we set up this village as a way to change that. We've provided a range of content, including talks and lab exercises. If you need to find any information, please first of all start with our website, which is thepaymentvillage.org. You'll find the schedule, information about how to access Discord, how to register for Discord, and how to access our Twitch and YouTube channels. We have a number of talks over the three days, and all of those are going to be broadcast to Twitch and YouTube. All of the information for that will be provided in Discord and following each talk we will have a Q&A session which will take place on Discord. This will be moderated by myself and by Tim who is one of the Payment Village staff. So after this talk we have a talk by Dr Stephen Murdoch from UCL and he's going to be talking to us about TLV. So when we look at the communication between a card and a terminal for EMV, the data is sent in units called Application Protocol Data Units or APDUs. Now within each message that's sent, the data is sent in a structure called TLV or Tag, Length and Value. So he's going to be talking to us about why this is important, how we can understand it and how we can decode it. So following that talk, we have a talk from Tim Unisoff, and he's going to be talking to us about how you can get started with bug bounty for payments. I think what's particularly interesting about this talk is, is he's going to talk about some of the challenges that are specific to this area. On Saturday, we have a talk from Yuri Rivner of Biocatch, and he's going to be discussing identity as identity data as a commodity. So he's going to be talking about all sorts of interesting things like synthetic IDs, which are a particular problem in the US. So this might be where a fraudster creates an ID from constructed data. Some of that might be real. So for example, using the social security numbers of deceased people or children. So I'm particularly interested in seeing this talk and what he has to say about that. Then we have a talk by Arkady Litvinenko and he's going to be talking about online banking security. Specifically, he's going to focus on the difference between online banking security assessments and traditional application assessments. So we'll be looking at some specific issues that are associated with banking security, some of which will be focusing around the actual logic of the application. On Sunday, we have a talk by Alexei Stenikov and he's going to be talking about the security or lack of security in point of sales terminals. Alexei is a hardware reverser, so he'll be talking about the security mechanisms that we can find commonly within terminals and how those can be bypassed. Following Alexi, we have a talk by Menaka Baska Pillai, and she's going to be talking about how we can architect modern payment gateways and do this in a secure manner. In addition to the talks, we have a number of lab exercises which are available on our website. We'll be providing support for those in Discord. So under the Pay Labs text, you'll be able to post your questions and we'll get back to you. In addition to all of these things, we do have a number of stickers available. So if you're interested in that, please ping myself or Tim or just ping in the general chat. And please tag us online on Twitter using the tag at Payment Village. And finally, have an amazing time. I hope that this provides you with a great introduction into payments and you'll be keen to come back next year.